think? What do you think about it, sir? Oh, there. <laughs> G'day, how's it going? My name's Sam, and I'm from Room One Live. We've just had a whirlwind tour of the South Island for two and a bit weeks. And like I introduced to you, our mobile home, which has been a movable biohazard for the last two weeks. Now, come with me, mate. I'm going to show you how we're living. All right? Hey, hey, hey! Don't get excited. I am too. Stay. That dog. Like every good sea vessel or road vessel, one must need a captain and co-pilot. Now, like all good comrades on the road, we like safety first at Room One. One navigator and one driver. So you have two sets of eyes: four eyes, two arms, two hands. Hey, eh? safety. <laughs> living board with five guys is like living together with five dogs. You gotta respect each other's spaces, or else you're just gonna bark at each other. I'll tell you how we live, eh? Pretty shitty. Come on, have a look. Mind, mind your step coming in. This has been our workspace for the last two weeks. Now for five guys, a lot of Room 1 equipment, we've had to be very careful to where we put things. We've got many of these nooks and crannies that we've been able to store things in. We've got your first drawer that came with a lot of cutlery. God bless the RV team. Second drawer down. This was more our health and maintenance where TJ had his um, core pills that kept you up for a couple of days. Third drawer, party and entertainment. Um, obviously empty now, we've had a great two weeks. Back here was the Black Caps um, tribute corner uh, where Teller gave us live updates as well as Troy's the Black's um, social commentary on the World Cup. We, we weren't able to catch every game. This was um, also doubled as the medics corner where the sick people uh, slept, spewed, um, a top tip. you got to remember is that we're all sleeping in one area. There's a lot of condensation. Like, oh. if, I, if I piss myself, I bet I've pissed myself. Tal has pissed himself as well. It's fine if we're all pissed ourselves. Was it? It was the condensation. Top tip. Bring a dehumidifier on the trip, okay? This is that. This was actually a table the whole time, and we just didn't even know how to. Oh, oh my God! What did we know about this earlier? <laughs> this is my favourite part: uh, the bathroom facilities. Oh. This is full white decor and swivels, counterclockwise and clockwise. <laughs> um, and here you'd find a shower, reminiscent of an Otago University uh, kind of setup. Right around here's been what we would call um, the mana hours. This is where the this is where the work would go on during the tour. So any anything between um, shows on the road, work, play, work, play. Got the golden triangle. Good good synergy. Say if you can touch, touch like you, you know the most important things in your life, like by this, it's pretty good. We call this the soup kitchen. Wildest dreams come true. Your wildest sicknesses come true, I should say. When you have five guys breathing she sort of circulates up into like a kind of a, a perfect weather system which is its own kind of like environment so this is where TJ got a throat infection obviously v V12 fuel injected um, twin turbo sturdy vest sturdy vest obviously with any big vessel you need a wide berth this thing doesn't stop in a hurry. Once you get to six knots, you need to fucking put on full steam backwards for it to stop in time. Now the lifeline of this camper is LP gas. I'm not too sure what LP stands for. Life preserving gas? <laughs> We're kind of like the early pioneers of New Zealand as we just went forth into this frontier of complete raw terrain. Really proud of the boys stepping through and only using just a few simple luxuries like life preserving gas. <laughs> Given it's 2019 and going on such a world tour, hey, you gotta have the best in stress care. And we'd like to thank Vapo for fueling us with that body mana. A great white vape cloud, almost like a space rocket. And with that, the Vapo love was spread across all the corners of the South Island. And for that, we thank you, Vapo. <laughs> well, uh, that wraps up um, our, our little cribs tour of this, the mana bus, or the biohazard bus. But until next time, it will be a warmer climate and we'll be more prepared. Ha, ha, ha.